go. Okay, guys, good morning. We're going to have some fun, I hope. Now, I need two cups. I do need two cups here. We're going to top coat the, this one. Then we're going to pour into that one. Mixing that white. This one did a real weird, funky thing. Made a garden. <laughs> Made a garden, if you haven't seen the video. And we're going to up coat, top coat this one here. What we did the other day too. Now, we will have to pop some bubbles. I'm just going to pour right up to the end. Oh, ow. We're going to pour right up to the edge. I'm in shadow, aren't I? So I'll come this way. We're going to pour right up to the edge. Try not to overflow. We don't need to overflow. This, now, this is not a level mould anyway. This is not level, but my board is. I levelled it this morning. It works beautiful. But I took off the rubber silicone. Now, it bubbled in one area. Don't ask me why it bubbled. I don't know. I think the resin must have got too hot. Now we're just going to top coat this. Nice thin layer. Nice little thin layer. I'm just going to use my stick and take it right up to the edge. Now I'm not happy with that edge, but it's the only gold I've got. This up, not over. Don't go over. Same with the other mould. Don't go over. Just go up to the edge. May make it a level top. I don't know. This is a test piece, guys. We drew on it. It's about 10 videos ago, maybe 20 videos ago, we did the drawing. Just bring it up to the edge. In my head when you're resining get yourself comfortable level your board if you got one level your table make sure you're perfectly level number two put your gloves on no number two is go to the little boys room or girls room the bathroom Number three, make a drink. Number four, put your gloves on. Stir your resin for five minutes. I do mine for five minutes. It works beautiful for five minutes. Now, I love this piece. It's so unusual. We're going to try and do it again. We are definitely going to try and do it again. Now, is it fully covered? We're going to try. I'm just taking it right to the edge. Doesn't matter if it goes over on this one. But I just want to go right to the edge. Yes, I've got a broken glove. He broke, second time wearing. Now we may have to spray these. In fact, we will have to spray these. Now, I'm also going to do that tree. How's he look? I think he looks pretty darn good, actually. <laughs> it was supposed to be an ordinary blue. You know what the girls do? You know what Julie does? Pouring your heart out. Morning, Julie. And glitz and glitter. She does them too. She does the perfect blooms. Me? Yeah. But yet again, look at the effects I've got. i got flowers in the... Uh, I don't know if that's a mountain range or waterfall. 
I don't know. I can't work that out. If that's a mountain or waterfall and the flowers are growing up. Now the next worry is that I'm going to tint. I'm going to try something. See if we can get the same effect. Now it is stripping a little bit, but that's fine. It's fine. We're not worried too much about the dripping. I've got grease poof paper down. Hopefully it won't stick to the board. I've given up on the rubber and the silicone. Now we're going to do this one. Thin layer again. I'm going to do a thin layer. Very thin layer. I'm just going to pour it in. But my board is perfectly level because I double checked it. It's a nice thin layer. A nice thin layer. Now, we've got way too much. So we'll keep some of this back. We've got to mix up our white. And we've got two for colour. We've got to mix up some white. I'm going to do the spirals again. How are we looking for bubbles on the other one? Let me just give them a squirt. Let me give it a little squirt. I don't want bubbles if I don't have to have bubbles, now do we? Now, white. I'm thinking I want a little bit of white anyway. A little bit of white. Now, I know you won't be able to see it. Let me shrink. There you might. That's our first one. That's our first one. Something's in there from the stick. Or is it just a bubble? Don't know. I'll take it right up to the edge. Now, we need that. Now, I'm going to get this one. So we'll do the same with this one. This is our Christmas tree mould. This is our Christmas tree mould. So I'm just going to pour it in. Pour it in. Get him in there. And I want to, mm, not much. No, we'll, I'll pour it in this one. And we'll add some red to it. Hang on. It's a very warm day today, very warm. I've got all the sun coming in my window. I've got the blinds drawn. But it's a beautiful sunny day. Now, we've had some weird weather, but I'm not too worried about the weather. Now, we've got that one. I'm just going to pour a little bit of white. Here, put it in there because I want some red. I want some red. I know I want red. I want red. Maybe the crackle effect we'll try and get. So we've limited it down, so we've got plenty of time. Now I want my white. Same white that I used yesterday, actually. I want the same white that I used yesterday. I got my black pigment paste yesterday. Got my black pigment paste. So yay. Now we're going to mix up this one. This is my pigment white. Wipe it off. Wipe it off. I want it a bit opaque, a bit more opaque. It's a little bit off. Popping in there. And we'll see if we have to add any... Um, now, where's the red? Where's the red? Burgundy? No, I don't want burgundy. 
green close but no cigar I want a red red there's red there's red there we go I want red in the Christmas tree now what's that in there must be coming off the that out if we can now I could have done the brush the gold onto the red and all that you know around the edges but I just want clear come on what are you doing in there already I just want a nice clear so we're going to try for another effect I want to mix up the um no I didn't do it that way yes I did I no I didn't oh no I did not I did not do it that way okay well, we'll keep that we'll keep that for a minute okay another idea another idea come in my head now I add some of that in just mix it in we want it opaque. We want it opaque. Now, where's my other one? And I put some of this in. And then I put in Julie's one. I put in Julie's. Popped in Julie's. Craft and craft. That goddess effects. That got us that effect, so a couple of drops of that. Go for three. Three's a nice lucky number. Then we'll do a top coat of that dark green. Yes, now I didn't do that with that one, no. I did not do that. Now, how does it look? I'm just going to turn it upside down. Mm, a bit darker, I think. A little bit darker. I do want that same effect if I can get it. So six drops. We have got some bubbles in that one. There we go. One squirt. One squirt. If we get a bloom of, if we get that bloom that Julie talks about, well, we just have to get that bloom. I do not want bubbles. I do not need bubbles. Now, I'm not going to do the spirals in that same way. I'm going to try to do the spirals in a different way. Ah, uh, that's a bit better. Another one. I want another one. I want it opaque. A little bit more opaque. But not too much more. Now, Miss Wanda got my parcel that I sent her and she loves it. Uh, that's good. I'm just wondering if she filmed it while she was opening it. <laughs> I'll find out in the next video what she does. He loves my parcel. Just some bits and pieces that coaster I made. I didn't like it, but everyone else liked it. Go figure. Now, I think we're ready. Now, I want this paper cup. I want this small paper cup. Now, there is some bits in it, but it should be all right. Let's try. Now, we want to keep some white back. Now, we can pinch it. Pinch him. Very, very slow. Go so slow that it never looks like it's coming out. Just 
do a spiral. We want those little bumps. You want that? Okay. Now, now, put that back in there. That's done that purpose. Now, I really can't do no more resining until next week. Now, I'm going to come. I'll go this way. That's a little bit better. I can see it now. No, I like it wide. I want to keep it wide. So we've got it wide. We have got it wide. Now, what did I do yesterday with that? Tr to get that snowy effect. Oh, mother. <laughs> yeah. um, I put my drops in. Now that's not a pigment, that's a pigment. I used the alcohol yesterday, didn't I? Uh, na, 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 na. They're all pigments. What's this one? This has got red, green, and gold. So red, green, and gold. I want red, green, and gold. Doesn't matter if there's a little bit of white in there. Now, how's our other ones looking? I think they're okay. Now we've got red, green, and gold. Mica powder. Then I'm going to try... Oh, I'll have to go to the library. Find a library and print it off my phone. I've got a real good one of mum. Sitting in the cabin. Reading a book. Oh, I want to put her picture on that one. But we have to do the picture first, of course. We'll have to do the part A first. How's that looking? That's nice. That is nice. Red, green and gold. Okay, that's okay. Put them in there. Now. Now. Okay, now, 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 now. Think, 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 think. Brain. I didn't do it this way. That's a crackle effect we're going for. We're going for a crackle. Now, how does a mould get dirty when a mould has never been used? Ooh, that's doing something funky. But it's going to be totally different from that. Okay. Now, I'm going to pour in. I'm going to pour the two together. So a kiss effect, like you do in paint pouring, like a little kiss effect. Just do a little, the two colours are kissing. Now, this will be opaque. Uh, well, no, we'll mix it in like a marbling effect. We've got a little bit left, that's all. We've got a little bit left. Now, let's use up that. And we'll put him in here as our little background. Oh, that looks good. 
That does look good. Okay. So we only got a little bit left over. Let's go for it, guys. Let's go get off of there. I don't need you on there touching that poor bugger. Yeah, I'm just going to spread that to the edge. There we go. Now, I'm just going to push it around. No heat. I'm not using any heat. I am going to add, if I can find it, my silver. My silver alcohol ink. And we're just going to drop it in, in the corners. And then I will top coat with the green, with the old green again. That dark green, a little bit later today, so I'm keeping that cup out. Keeping that cup out. We're just going to see what it does. See what effect it does. Same in this one. There's some big blobs. Now that, that went through there. That's got to go through there. There's a hole up there. Okay, some silver. What else have we got? Some peacock. We'll go for the peacock. Peacock blue. I like peacock. into the corners, down the center. Let it mix and mold and gel. There we go. I've got no lights to put in this one. I'm not putting lights in and struggling with my lights. <laughs> no, I'll let the experts do that. No way. No way am I struggling with my, with my thing above. So this is the back. This is the back. The front will be whatever the front will be. I'm hoping for that snowy effect. I'm hoping for a snowy effect. Now, what other ones have I got in here? Pigment. No, I don't want pigment. Oh, that's right. I used a little bit of black, didn't I? Brown. This pigment. I only had it yesterday. Pigment. Burgundy. No, I don't want burgundy. I want black. to do blue pigment silver gray white oh, bloody marvelous you can never find what you want okay that's it, I'm done. We'll just have to see how it does. Oh, let's put some white alcohol in. White alcohol ink. It has got the pearl in it. It's doing something. Okay, not going to be the same effect. Let's put a little bit of white, a little bit of extra white in around the tips. 
around those tips. We'll see what it does. Wish I could find the black, blue, pigment, pigment black ink. I don't want black ink. That's it. I'm done. A is a done. Now, got one good glove, one bad glove. I can't do no more. So I'll do the other half when I top coat with the green. I will. Oh, that's got to wait. Oh. Oh, that's going to be clear, isn't it? That's got to be clear. Now, that part will have to wait until I get my picture printed out. And I want a really good quality picture too. And I don't know if the library's print on um, thing about now. I'll just give that a little squirrel again. Squirrel it in, just swirl it. We'll see what it looks like in the morning when I demold that part. Swirl in the alcohol. What am I talking? Spiral in it. Give it a marble effect, hopefully. Well, it's done. We're done. We're done. We're done. It's all I can do until it sets up, until we do the top coat. And that has to wait because that's got to be, that's the background. Really, we did. Hmm. Hmm. That was. We shouldn't have done that. No, oh, well, we'll just come back to it. And the next time I put the top coat on, I won't have any gloves. Oh, that's all right. I'm only stirring it in, stirring in the colour of the green. I've got to find my black though. Where did my black go? Oh, I'll find my black. That's empty. Got to wash that out. Wash that out. Keep them. Do not throw them little jars away. Okay, guys. Happy hands. Happy tangling. I will come back later and I'll top coat these. That is definitely not going to be that. I can tell by, by looking out. I know the light's annoying you, but I can't do nothing about the light. Otherwise, you wouldn't see that way. There we go. No, you can't really see. There we go. I don't know what that one will do until we demold in the morning. Okay, happy hands, happy tangling. Please subscribe. We're having fun with resin. I've still got about two litres left. In my, in my big bottles. So, yay. This one's going to be interesting. This one's going to be the interesting one, I think. But we'll top coat with the green and black. I'll go searching for my green and black. See what we can get. 11.34. I'll cut cooking my pork chop. won't take long in the frying pan. My friend marinated it yesterday, Mr. Rick. So he marinated one yesterday, so I shall cook him up. Nice and slowly. You'll top coat that with the green. Black, green and black I used to get that green. Be interested to see what this one does. <laughs> okay guys happy hands lots and lots of fun now will that stick to my board or... no it's not coming through that's good it's not coming through to the board that's good then we can just pick it up and throw it in the bin i've had that rubber silicone rubber that does buckle 
I don't know why, it must have been the heat. Now that should be nice now. Okay. Have fun. Play safe. I don't know if we're going to get the same effect I got in the last one. So I've done it differently. I just don't know if I want to... That's quite nice, actually, the way it is. But it's got to be turned over. It has to be turned over. Just give that a swirl in there. I want the colours to go to the other side. Now I want the colours to down the other end. Okay, that's it. I'm done. Bye. Please subscribe. Have fun. Yeah, we're watching it, aren't we? Because that is on the back. I mean, we've got to have a clear top on that. That could have been a little bit deeper, but we've got to have a clear top on that part there, the round part. Got to be clear. It'll have to be some sparkles, maybe, some bit of sparkle in it. That's it. I'm gone. I'm done. I am done, although I can see something without looking at it. It's not gone to the edge. I'll just fix that up there. Is this not gone to that edge there, which is typical. It is very typical with resin. Ah, now I've got white on the bloody end of it. Ah, leave things alone. I'll just get rid of that. There we go. I'll just get rid of that. There we go. Now I'm done. I'm going. You didn't see that. Bye. <laughs>